This is a demonstration of the OSGR tool, which you reach from the plugins menu, Tom Bio Productivity Tools, and you'll see it in there. By default, it opens docked in the bottom left hand corner of QGIS. Uh, this is a good option because it doesn't interfere with the map, but if you did want to move it elsewhere, you can. You simply by dragging is a standalone dialog, or you can dock it to the other side of the screen, etc. But I find it convenient to have it docked in the bottom left because it doesn't interfere with the map. It gives me the maximum map canvas available to me. So the basic function is very simple. As you move the mouse cursor over the map, you'll see the grid reference of the uh, mouse cursor reflected uh, in this box here. So that's set to six figure grid reference now, as you can see from this drop down here. So I move the map, or sorry, the mouse over the map, you'll see the grid reference updated. And if I change the value in that drop down box there, for example, to Tetrad, that is reflected now in the grid reference you see in the box here. So as I move over the ma uh, map again, you'll see the Tetrad grid references appearing there. It can be a bit distracting to have the grid references constantly changing because you, you might find the point, of, uh, the point of interest here, but you move the mouse and it changes down here. You can avoid that by having this on click checkbox uh, engaged and then you'll only get the grid reference where you actually click on the map like so. You can also see the grid square corresponding to a grid reference by checking this box. If I change to hectad, which is 10k square here, so it's nice and obvious, you'll see that appearing on the map wherever we click. And if we have the on click checkbox unchecked, you'll see that that square is dynamically updated as you move the mouse over the map. So that's a very simple way of finding out where you are on a map, any, any, any UK map, anywhere in the country, um, by using this tool. You can also navigate to a specific grid reference. So if, for example, I change the grid reference shown here to one that I know, in this case a monad, a one kilometre grid square, uh, SD6414, this is for a square in Lancashire, and then click locate, the, mouse is re uh, the map is repositioned on that grid square. You can see that it's the precision of the grid square that I entered is reflected up here too. And that very simply is how you use this tool to find your way uh, around a map using OS uh, grid references.